Hey guys, Miss Jager here, and welcome back to my Fallout 4 long play. You okay? That's a bit weird. Is that Dan's? No, that's just. That's weird. Anyway, slight glitch out there. Anyway, so in my last episode, we did. Oh, she's alive. Uh, in my last episode, we did some uh, soul-searching, some identity-revealing, and some surprising moments. And also, a moment of cheating, admittedly, but it was for a commonly good cause. Because, unfortunately, um, Dan's... Uh, spoilers! Dan's um, was a synth. An unknown, unknown to him. He didn't know he was a synth. Um, he, was he, he was just as surprised as we were. So, obviously, I didn't want to kill him, because he's a good bloke, you know? But, obviously, Maxon, being a douchebag that he was, not only told me to go kill him, but he also followed me to fucking where Maxon was. So, where Dan's was. So, when it comes to keeping the one running. um, yeah. I don't think I'm going to get his, uh, approval, to be honest with you. But, um, take my helmet off. But, at the same time... I basically cheated the system, gave myself better charisma to convince Paladin Dance that there is worth, there is life, you know, it's worth, life is worth it, you know, it, it's worth it. Obviously, I also had to kind of still use the same 10 uh, charisma to convince Maxon to let him go because he followed me. Uh, but as you can see, I put it back, I put it back at the end of the last episode to a reasonable level, so now we're normal. So I'm not breaking the game Three immersion. Accurate. Now, efficiency. reporting is ordered, Elder. Before we continue, I want to make one thing clear. This conversation will be the last time we speak about Dance. As far as the Brotherhood of Steel is concerned, he's dead. Do you understand? I'll never understand it. But I'm not going to mention him again. Then consider this a lesson to reflect upon as your service to the Brotherhood continues. Of course. Dance's execution creates a missing link in our chain of command. That traitor held quite an important position with us. I'm certain that you'll make a fine replacement. His quarters and all his possessions are now yours, including his personal suit of power armor. Congratulations, Paladin. I'm honored, Elder. You've earned it by your own actions. Just be aware that a Brotherhood Paladin is expected to be a symbol of integrity to our brothers and sisters. I trust you won't disappoint them or disappoint me. In any event, we still have the Institute to contend with and a lot of work to do before we can begin our final assault. God damn While it! the finishing touches are being put onto Liberty Prime, Captain Kells has identified a potential threat to our operations. Report to him immediately for your next assignment. Ad Victorium, Paladin. Ad Victorium. Oh boy. Where is he? Oh, is he downstairs? Okay, he's downstairs. So, yeah, we uh, have to. Oh. That's the. That's the railroad, isn't it? Adjusting internal balanet pressure. That's the fucking railroad. The board. This is not oh, good. Paladin. Good. Now that the unfortunate matter regarding dance has been settled, we can return to our primary mission. Do you think dance's execution was justified? It's quite obvious dance was a traitor. Uh -huh. That machine's presence was in danger. Your actions in this matter were not only uh -huh. with all of that behind us. Sure. I'm ready, Captain. Good, because this mission demands your full attention. Now, before we launch our attack on the Institute, we need to address another threat, the railroad. They're a small but capable group that uses subterfuge and guerrilla tactics to harass their enemies. Our tactical analysis says they could possibly hamper or harm our operations. Why? Which is a risk I'm not willing to take. If we strike them now, we should be able to maximize the amount of damage we do to their organization. Fine, but it hardly seems worth Oh, for worth fuck's sake, not now. The railroad may not appear to be destroying the rail to that end. No. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't want to attack them. God damn it. Just give me the exact words. Not random words. Exact words. Like, 
I want to attack. I don't want to attack. God damn it. Ah, uh, no. We're going to be doing it differently. Oh. Uh, not what I want to see. Oh, god damn it. Right. One moment. Right, Secondary we're back. Standing by. Ah, Paladin. Good. Now that the unfortunate matter regarding dance is... Uh-huh. Right. I'm ready, Captain. Good. Now... Uh -huh. They're a small right. Our attack, if we strike them. Uh huh. Why is the railroad such a threat? Even with their relatively small numbers, the railroad is a constant threat to our operations. They've already proven to be resilient against superior forces. With a knack for disappearing when cornered, worse still, they possess the capability to help synths flee the Institute. If we intend to end the synth menace, we need to plug the leaks. Destroying the railroad hinges on completely eliminating their leadership. Otherwise, they'll simply regroup somewhere else. To that end, here's a list of the five targets we believe would cause a catastrophic failure in their chain of command. Do they all have to die? Absolutely. It's the only effective way of ensuring that they're no longer a threat. Now, before you depart, Proctor Ingram has additional orders oh, to complete. Boy. Our sources tell us that the railroad has some sort of experimental or prototype robot in their headquarters. They're calling it the Predictive Analytic Machine. They use the robot for complex strategic. If you could use this holotape to decrypt the security on Pam's terminal, it will force the unit to return to the Pridwin. I'm certain we could put Pam's computing power to good use. Otherwise, destroy it. Collecting technology for you is becoming a habit, Proctor. <laughs> a habit you appreciate, I hope. I'm certain the Paladin, when you're ready, pro uh -huh. they'll provide demolition support and all the firepower you'll need. Add Victorium, Paladin. Okay. Okay, so once again, we're going into shit. For fuck's sake. Okay. I could let the attack hit me and make me go down like a little bit, or I could block it and stay standing. I'm really curious now as to what the hell he's attack that is attacking him. It's... Oh, it's that. Okay. Right. So, now we're on... Uh, oh, okay, I apparently failed my tradecraft, and my computer is taking longer to load the data. I doubt that. Right, anyway. Because it's middle of the night and it's raining, I want to do this. Do, do, do. Why? I landed in a tree. <laughs> anyway, that was fun. Anyway, so obviously I don't want to go for Paladin, nor do I want to knock out the railroad, so I'm hoping we can somehow find. Um, a way of disabling them and saying, look, get the fuck out of here and run, you know, um, and help them out. I know I sound a bit like a hypocrite, but you know what? Having spent a while away from this game, I realized that the Brotherhood of Steel is becoming a fascist-like group, and I'm like, I don't want that. So, obviously... Obviously, um, I need to, you know, obviously things need, I, hopefully I can convince the, the people who are like, no, I will do this myself sort of thing. And then I'll be like, oh shit, I'm being attacked. <laughs> so hopefully, <laughs> so hopefully what we can do is somehow, I'm not saying it will work, but hopefully somehow we can, um, convince the railroad guys to not go anywhere near us, so that way we can somehow escape them and do other stuff. But I don't want to keep, like, losing people and dying. I'm hoping that no one goes near them. I really am hoping because they're good people. Like, yeah, sure, they're trying to save robots, but they're not that bad. Something tells me I'm going to regret my decision of joining the brother. I joined the, I joined the Brotherhood because I joined their old principles, which is 
Regulate the usage of technology, i.e. don't make any more supernatural big bombs like the fucking Enclave would. And, um, you know, instead come to a better, you know, instead, you know, oh crap, they're fighting already, aren't they? Alright, shit, we're gonna have to kill them. Grenade out. Grenade out. If we're going to do this, we're doing this. I'm doomed, aren't I? Like, you know, to hell and all that. Right. Right, anyway. Right, how do I get down again? I can't remember. Oh yeah, I remember. It was down here, isn't it? Yep. Go, 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 go! Let's do this. God damn it. Kill you if we have to. Just leave. Ad Victorium. I'm gonna be a bad guy now, aren't I? Everyone's gonna fucking hate me. Damn it. Where'd you go? Weather and a team. Kill him. Back up. Target down. Oh fuck, sorry. I'm terrible. I apologize, that was my bad. You can You can have something from me at some point in the future. Sure thing. I will die for the cause. No, you won't. Detonation pack secured and ready, sir. Area secured, Paladin. Okay. Get the fuck out. Oh. Get back here, you bitch! Hey. Reloading. For the sim. Another victory for the Brotherhood. Huzzah. Target located. Grenade out. Enjoy. Going weapons called. Oh yeah, I need some. Sh I need shit for my stuff. That's a thought. Assault rifle. I've got my uh, M19 uh, <laughs> 2019 A2. That's actually not a bad gun. I am so nicking your guns. Right, we have shit tons of ammo. Let's have some fun. I don't want to kill these people, but evidently I have to. So, shit. I'll uh, take the thing though and get the thing to return to the Pridwin. Let's try not to destroy these things. Look 
Oh shit. One down. Sorry, Deacon. Nothing personal. Sorry, Glory. Yes. I'll take you, Mac. I'll take your minigun. Say hello to my little friend. Oh, you are not getting away now, bitch. And the war has been won. Woo! Yeah! And now I feel like a douchebag. Yay. Well, to the victor go the spoils, I guess. But still. I don't feel happy. I don't feel good. I just feel... The game's making me feel like an asshole as well. It's like, well, look at you. Uh, I know, I probably am the bad guy, but... In my defense, I couldn't find a way to stop it from being that, you know? Right. I'm sorry. I am honestly sorry because I, I don't want to. I don't want to. I, I, I honestly don't want to. I didn't want to do this, but well, shit happens and now we're here. I am going to like do a bit of um, nicking and stealing and whatever. But no, it, it is just a bit like, ah. Uh, you know, like, I, I didn't want this to happen at all. There's a railroad rifle as well. Oh, I'm still unable to, um, kind of wish I could... Well, that said, if I can get into my power suit, then... Uh, I just feel bad, you know? Like, I don't want to fight them. I didn't want to fight them, but they gave me no choice. You know, there was nothing we could do. I guess they couldn't forgive too many mistakes. It's like if, um... Nothing we can do, really, is it? Nope. Sorry, railroad agent. Nothing personal, as said. I feel sorry for Tinker Tom as well. Like, all the people I've killed, I didn't want to. Oh well. Such is war. Perfect. Well, HQ is well. The HQ is now gone. That's it. No more rail. N no more railroad. Which is a bit of a shame. I imagine there'll probably be some people calling me an asshole because I killed that, but. Well, for that, all I can say is I'm sorry. I was under orders. I couldn't. I wanted to argue. I mean, hell, I, w I restarted. I loaded the sequence again because I was like, no, I don't want to talk. I don't want to just disregard them, you know, but they didn't give me any choice. It was like, you either become an asshole or you don't. Ah. Countermeasures active. This unit is incapable of voice communication. 
This must be Pam then. I'm nicking that. Right, okay. What can we do? Have a nice day. I'm sorry. Have a nice day. What? Pam. Security mode enabled. Voice interface is unavailable at this time. Uh Bingo. Ready for programming instructions. Recommend interface type R J one one G. Okay. Well, that's that battle fought and won. Oh, that is so cool. So, I guess this is it. Right, well. I feel bad, but I can't honestly say... Well, I feel sorry. I am, but nothing I can do. Shit happens, and... All we can do is just accept it for what it is. I don't like it, but... Oh. But that's how it's going to be, you know? There's nothing we can do or say. Oh, come on, really? Ow. Right, okay, hang on. I'm a little bit nervous as to the particulars of the environment I'm in. Oh, okay, I've got Raj. Okay, let's go and get have a rat away. Okay, we're safe. We're safe. I thought there were going to be some kind of like uh, mass... Oh, hello. Are we back in the same place? Huh. Guess not. Anyway... Oh, I see. Oh, there's some stuff there as well. A fusion core. God damn it. Well, at least I can hack into it. Nope. Oh, stumbling? Nope. Uh, purifying? Nope. God damn it. And now we get stuck on these things. I'm going to say it. Nope. Ah, come on. Right. Predators, no. Repairing? Ooh. Improving? No. Confusing? No. Absorbing? Nope. Fuck my life. Right, okay. Um, obviously, I'll do the routine. If I can't do it in like three turns or whatever, then I will... Or a few turns. Or basically when I can, you know, do it. Anyway. Suspected? No. Rambling? No. Overthrow? No. According. No. Oh, come on. Fuck's sake. Illness. No. 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 <sighs> right, one moment. I'll have to pause recording. BRB. And we're back. And we just literally, like, moment afterwards, I'm like, right, fuck it. Open this damn thing. And, um, I guessed it. <laughs> I was like, yes. Woo! Duck tape. Woo hoo. Oh, hello. That's a very nice weapons workbench. I shall enjoy this. Fusion core. 
Or I'm stealing everything. I'm such a bastard. Right. Let's go have some fun. Okay, so, now that we've captured, or oh, sorry, eliminated the railroad. Not that I'm exactly proud of that, mind you. Um, we should now hopefully get the chance to finish this war against the Institute. <sighs> this is annoying. The game keeps telling me, oh, what I should think or what I should feel. And I'm like, I'd like to make my own choice on that. Thank you. You know, rather than just assume I'm, um... Who's out there? Oh. Hello. That's Your worst nightmare. Hello. There you are. <laughs> there you are, and there I was. Ooh, shotgun. Do I have shotgun shells? Yes. Yes. Right. Okay. Let's return back to the Pridwin because we won the day. Not to say that I'm happy, but eh. I'm hoping that once we've um. Once we've sorted out the uh, whole thing, we can start assaulting the Institute relatively soon. Obviously, depending, of course, on what happens. Because, you know... I don't exactly... F oh, hang on. Reload. There we go. We'll stop the Institute. Well, I don't exactly feel loyal to Maxim any moment anymore. As far as I'm concerned, he's a knob. Well, it appears that the railroad won't be a hindrance to our future operations. I wish there'd been another way. The railroad was providing assistance to escape since, and was therefore deemed a security threat. Those sympathizers got exactly what they deserved. I'm also pleased you managed to secure Pam rather than allow it to be destroyed. We are having it brought to the Pridwin, where it will be installed in Proctor Quinlan's office. It's an amazing piece of pre-war technology that should prove to be quite beneficial to us. Speaking of pre-war technology, Proctor Ingram is putting the final touches on Liberty Prime and requires your assistance. Congratulations on another successful mission, Paladin. Ad Victorium. Yes, Ad Victorium. I don't exactly feel uh, very Victorian, though. I feel more dirty than Victorian, in all honesty. My loyalty to the Brotherhood of Steel is certainly l is waning. Glad to see you return safely from the Institute, brother. Yes, I'm over the moon. You know, I'm like ecstatic. You know, like. Ugh. I'm looking forward to the end of this thing because I'm just not feeling very uh, Brotherhood of Steely. Like, sure, um, Brotherhood of Steel is good in some regards, but you know, back in Fallout 4, they were the f uh, sorry, back in Fallout 3, the attention. Due to increased radar activity, all leave requests to off-base sites have been temporarily suspended. Affected parties will have their leave compensated at the next available opportunity. Taking on a death claw without backup is a great way to get yourself. Uh, I think the battle is about to start. You look like you've been through the ringer, Paladin. Don't say that I blame you. That was a hell of a business with dance. Can't even imagine having to look him in the face and pull the trigger. Honestly, I prefer not to talk about it. I hear you loud and clear, Paladin. Anyway, we need to move on to more important things now. Like getting Liberty Prime off of life support. We've been feeding him power through the Pridwin's engines, but there isn't nearly enough juice to cold start his fusion reactor. That's why we need you to find us a beryllium agitator. Again. Turning out to be quite a grocery list to get that hunk of junk running. Hey, I was handed a crate full of burned out spare parts with no blueprints, and I still managed to get the big guy put back together. If we find this last piece, I promise you, he'll be combat ready in a matter of hours. Good job. Quinlan dug up some dirt on a company called Mass Fusion. They were a power utility company before the world went belly up. The CEO was some kind of an inventor. 
dreamed up all sorts of nuclear power toys. The Agitator was his crown jewel. Records show he was working on it in his lab at the top of their high-rise in the financial district. That's where we're headed. Hope you don't mind a little company, because I'm coming with you. Why would you want to go? Are you kidding me? Mass fusion was on the cutting edge of atomic technology. And considering there hasn't been much in the way of engineering advancements lately, that makes it a goddamn gold mine. I'm not gonna miss an opportunity like that. Okay. It would be helpful if you tagged along. I knew you'd see it my way. Kells has a vertebrate on standby waiting to drop us off on the roof of the mass fusion tower. Yay. Grab whatever gear you need and meet me on the flight deck. But don't take too long. God damn it. If the Institute finds out the agitator's there, they'll do everything they can to keep it out of our hands. But I got so much shit. Uh, okay, I'm going to say screw it. I'm going to nick all this stuff. And I'm just going to just I'm just going to hold it here like in the Right, I'm going to I I shouldn't really do this, but I have to. Uh, power armor, store all junk. Boom, there we go. Uh, armor workshop, anything. Really? Right. Really fucking wish I could remove those. Weapons, 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 weapons. Welcome weapons. aboard, brother. Still can't believe Dance was really a simp. Goddamn traitor. Right. Just quickly transfer these weapons over so I can't, um, I don't, right. Transfer that. Uh, transfer that. Transfer that that because I don't need any melee weapons what the fuck else do I have oh yeah that okay Paladin Proctor heard you cleaned house over at railroad HQ I'll take a look sure I've got uh -huh. right Oh, thank the Emperor. Right, okay. Moonshine, Bourbon, buff out. Yep. I do not want to keep taking this stuff. So, boom, boom. Uh... Boom. Anything I can get addicted to. Okay, cancel. Nice. Right, apparel, beer, junk, laser wa laser beta wave tuner. Okay. Right, I'm thinking if we get some... Oh my god, yeah. Oh god, that's too much. No! Um, I'll go a thousand. Uh, what do five rounds? Oh, let me guess. I just, I just. Congratulations on the promotion. Uh huh. I'm looking for some firepower. All of my work. Let me guess. I still have my fucking aid, don't I? Yes. Right. For fuck's sake. I hate this thing. Right. You. No. Yes. Yes, yes. No, my iguana bits. Uh, jet, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Uh, Radex, no, that's fine. Um, whiskey, okay, fine. Right, confirmed trade, good. Um, 500 rounds, 3276. I would literally be running out of cash if I did that. Uh, I'm thinking... Four, four, five. 
Fragmentation grenade. Right, there we go. If Dumb and Ugly had a child, it'd be a super mutant. Right, okay, I think we're good for the moment. Obviously, we're coming up for the end of the episode now, so what I'll do is I'll round things off here. Slightly early, I know, but technically speaking, the last couple of episodes, for fuck's sake, <laughs> we'll finish things off. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. This is Miss Jager signing out. If you like this kind of content, do let me know in the comment section down below. Click on the like button, and of course, subscribing to the channel. I'll see you next time.